Hello, and welcome everybody to our new playthrough, first playthrough of Marvel Midnight Suns. Um, I've seen a little bit of this game from uh, Christopher Odd, one of my favorite YouTubers. Uh, I've been looking forward to this game, as you guys know. I love strategy games, I love Marvel, I love all that kind of stuff, so I'm super excited for this. Um, seen about the first <clears throat> two hours or so of the game, but I don't think that's going to matter because there's a lot of this game to get through, so here we go. Uh, we're going to hop right into... Let's see the options real quick. There we go. Seems like that'll be good. Uh, I did see this. We're going to drop this down. Hey everyone, welcome to our new playthrough on the channel Marvel Midnight Suns, a Marvel strategy game by the guys who made XCOM and XCOM 2 for Axis. I'm super excited about it. It's kind of a card battler type thing, which I've been getting into a lot. You guys will see across the obelisk uh, coming up on the channel here soon. I've been in a bit of a uh, superheroes with Gotham Knights and card battler type uh, feeling mood lately. So this fits in perfectly for that mood. So with that, we're going to hop into a new game. Uh, we only have access to normal right now, so we're just gonna bop right into that. And we're gonna do the tutorial, and I'll see you guys then. Just what the hell is so important? Sleeping mother, sacred harbinger, awaken and reclaim what is yours. You who rise with the moon in darkness. Who prepares the path for the Midnight Sun? Turn your merciless eyes upon us and arise! Nice show, Doc. Next time, call Zemo. Better yet, I'll just shoot you and save us all the trouble. Head back to your magic castle, you ain't welcome here.
It's called a sanctum. And welcome or not, this is where fate has determined the Sorcerer Supreme needs to be. Tell fate answers no. This is the secret guardian you dragged me 5,000 miles to meet? Who's the mouth? Mr. Stark is brash, but I assure you, he can be trusted. Wait, you seriously don't know who I am? The fabric of magic is shifting, Johnny. The prophecy of the Midnight Sun is upon us. Your last crusade cost me plenty. This time, I intend to look after my own. Hey, pal, I don't think you understand. Things are changing. Two plus two no longer equals four. Up is sometimes down, and strange here is actually starting to make sense. Do I look like someone who gives a damn about any of that? No, you look like you should be bouncing for the double deuce. Listen, all I know is Hell's coming, and my pal here says you can help. That's where you're wrong. Hell's not coming. It's already here. You're welcome, Robo-Man. Iron Man? It's okay. It's fine. I know what he meant. Okay. We come all the way out here, and the old man runs off with that precious page of yours. Uh. We selected some VIP passes for the carnival, and we've blown up a few monsters on the way out. Johnny Blaze has sacrificed a great deal for this world already. I am certain he will come around given time. I thought you said time was the one thing we didn't have. Uh, all right, let's just wrap this up. I got about sand in my nanopolymer weave. <laughs> all right, so uh, I have never played this game before, so we are going to do the tutorial. Uh, just a heads up for the rest of the playthrough, we are going to listen to pretty much every dialogue option. I'm going to try to be quiet while they're talking. Um, I might not always be able to be quiet while they're talking because I'll be in the middle of a thought or whatever, but for the most part, we're going to try to be quiet while they're talking and just engage in the story. So the three main types of cards, which represent hero abilities, attack skills, and heroics. Playing a card costs one card play. Select an ability with left mouse button to activate it, then select a target with left mouse button to confirm the ability. Each turn you receive three card points. Okay. Uh, how to play. Use attack cards to damage enemies and gain heroism. Attack cards damage enemies. All attacks grant one heroism when used. Some attacks have additional effects. Alright. So we'll do this. Is there like motion blur on this? It kind of looks like there might be. We'll Let's mess that up. That was really something. And then we'll hit this guy too. Yeah, and you're ugly too. Am I really gonna have to bring out the big guns for this? Heroism and heroic cards. Heroic cards are powerful and decisive. Playing heroic cards require heroism. Gain heroism by playing attack and skill cards. Okay, so we got air superiority here. I think I need to turn on the graphics real quick. Just real quick. Let's just turn them down to high. Let's see what we get from that. That looks like it's running a little smoother for you guys. Alright, so air, air superiority will confirm the ability. Interesting tactic. All right, end your turn. Press X then. Oh, you have to hold it. All right. Okay. I'm feeling good about the situation, all things considered. There are two types of enemies: minions and elites. Minions have no health; any damage defeats them instantly. They are frail but still dangerous. Elites have higher health totals and require more damage to defeat. Tip, use attack and heroic cards wisely. High damage cards may be wasted on minions. Yeah, that that makes suit sense. may be a marvel of technology, but it's no match for the mystic arts. So these I'm guys have health bars. Start. Those guys do not. Oh, so it's a contest now. Then you take the extra creepy one. 
Some cars have the knockback effect. After selecting a target, aim the knockback direction to view potential impact points. Confirm the direction with left mouse button to push the enemy unit. Okay. How much damage does this do? I don't know how much damage this does. Oh, interesting. Okay. So what if I hit this guy into this guy? You know what? Let's do it like this. I'm going to knock these guys into each other. doesn't care about you. I hope you realize that in time. And then we are going to... Oh, we could have hit those guys into each other. That would have knocked them out. Okay, okay. Would you expect? And then the heroic on that guy. Sure, that makes sense. Now we have to end our turn. They're gonna get a hit in because we messed up. Alright. I must be the popular one today. At the start of each turn, hero icons will icons will appear above each enemy, showing who that enemy intends to attack. Use this information to determine which enemies to defeat first or which heroes to defend. In this case, Doctor Strange is in danger. See what you can do to assist. Now that I have their attention, perhaps a blessing is in order. Something protective? Well, I can give you a hand, or a shield in this case. Use skill cards. I'll accept your offer. Use skill cards to control the battle and gain heroism. Skills provide powerful supplemental effects like healing, damage boost, and drawing cards. Skills do not generally deal damage. Skills are a great way to build heroism for powerful attacks that provide more heroism than attack cards. Alright, so apply it to him. I won't forget this. Alright, so we kind of need to do a lot here. I got to do more here than I was hoping. I stopped these guys into each other. Learn, my friends. I fully intend to make this as miserable as possible for you. Fair warning. Um. Can we knock him into him? Yeah, let's do that. Apparently our reputation isn't enough to scare. And unfortunately, because we kinda of messed up before, he's gonna take some hits. Although he's protected. Don't break my resolve that easily. Okay. So you guys want to fight, huh? I think we pissed them off. Got a spell for that, maybe? Interesting. A spell changed the very demeanor of our enemies. Something along the lines of the psionic manipulations of Eros of Titan? If you can't make it happen in the next 10 seconds, I'm not interested. Okay, so... Okay, the music just randomly cut out. Let's try this. Let's do this. Let's start off with this. That's the spirit. Come around. Do winds of platoon. Oh, knock you into you. Prepare your Cool. And then we'll blast this guy. For what's about to happen. Your armor, because it looks like junk. Environmental attacks. Many objects on the battlefield can be used to your advantage with environment attacks. Environment attacks cost heroin, but do not cost 
Do not use a card play. These free attacks are very useful. Use them wisely to score important knockouts. Try using one or more rocks to wipe out extra enemies. Environment objects will glow when they can be used to attack them. And while you punch your arrows, maybe we should just try throwing a big rock at him? Yeah, let's do that. Here we go. <laughs> I like it. If I'm being honest, that encounter went better than I expected. Tony, I've been noticing a recurring gamma spike. You see, this is why you shouldn't eat spicy food, Bruce. Localized in the West Village, converging on the Sanctum. What? The collective works of the universe's greatest sorcerers, and he left them underneath the takeout menus. Shifting mystical polarities are wreaking havoc on my portals. You don't say. You okay, kid? Yes. Are you? Let's, uh, put a pin in that. Oh. Carol. Bruce and I have been trying to reach you. He'd have come himself, but he's... Well, you did the big green guy proud. I really showed up my homeowner's insurance. Miss Maxim, the wards of protection, if you please. Stephen, I can fight. I've got control now. Then show me by activating the wards. In the meantime, in honor of our missing companion, the rest of you may feel free to smash away. Never surrender. Let's proceed then. Nice one, Carol. Always the direct approach. Hmm. You know I don't right. mess around. Besides, we picked up some crazy gamma readings coming from, well, here. Guess okay. that explains the Hydra goons and ominous green lights. I would assume so. Yes, but not while you failed to use the front door. Um, hi, how about we discuss proper hero landing etiquette after we take down the bad guys? I feel like my mouse is like getting stuck. You move on to the enemies and it gets like stuck on them for some reason. I'm not sure why. Kind of weird. Anyways, uh, so. These are minions. These are not. What we want to do is, I think, use tab to quickly switch between targets when the card's selected. Okay, but you don't see actually who is targeted, so that's not as helpful. By the will of Love the effort. This costs three heroism. Uh, let's hit this guy. Good. Use redraw to replace undesirable cards in your hand. Highlight a card to redraw, then hold R to replace it with a new one. The new card is random, but it may be more immediately useful. Okay. The last card in your hand is Photon Beam. Cost three heroism, you only have two. Try to redraw it. Redraw it. Okay, so let's I'm hit this guy. And then five damage, jab him. I'm on it. I know that wasn't your signature move. And then we end turn. We will never forsake her. I'm not really sure there's another way to do that, honestly. Alright. Use move to reposition a hero and set up the perfect knockback angle, area, area of effect attack, or environment attack. Instructions, select any location on the ground with left mouse button to enter move mode, select again to move there. Alright, sure. 
let's move him there. Press the tab to switch between heroes, sure. Ah, okay, there we go. I can't... Ooh, I don't really like the... Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, kick it. Isn't that what I just did? Okay, that was supposed to hit more of them. I was pretty sure that I just line this up that way, but I guess not. This shouldn't take long. Up to five cards will be drawn to fill your hand at the start of each turn. Consider which cards to play and which cards to redraw and keep oh, each turn. Sure. That Davenport was at least a century old. What a waste. Um, that well, looks good. We don't have any moves. Knockback is kind of a waste here. But maybe that's not terrible. Draw the last two attacks played. What did we get? I think we just got jabs, right? So what if we do this? Watch closely. The light shines on the most dutiful. Okay. I mean not the greatest ever. Sure, why not? Whatever gets the job done. Didn't she get something for Javin's Oh, that's the the special card that she got, yeah. Alright, so punch. Seems like it'd be cheaper just to replace you guys with robots. I bet Tony would cut off the deal. Are moving right along. Use what you've learned to wipe out. Evil and all that. Use what you've learned to wipe out Hydra's forces in these guys. Just keep showing up. New plan. Double they your current hero. Surprisingly heroine. relentless. In any event, we must provide Wanda the time she needs to activate the wards of protection. Okay, we do have more card plays. Here we can do this. Let me show you. To weaken them. You've been deceived by Lilith, and it may very well it's cost you your play. life. I think we redraw this to do this. Can we? Let's move her here, because then she can photon beam these guys. Impressive. And then she can. Do we not have enough here? Is there anything else around that we can interact with? It does not look like it. I'm not gonna be able to kill one. You kill him. I really like the way that this looks, man. Oh, it looks so good. Not bad. Not great, but not bad. I'm wondering if there was a better way we could have done that. Let's not waste any more time. We're three of the world's strongest. Knock him out. Doesn't this should be easier? I've punched through scroll star cruisers that went down faster. Something's up. Yes, Hydra has clearly raised their game. And I have a terrible suspicion as to how. Wards. Something's blocking them. Not something. Someone. Go 
closer? Lilith, mother of demons, harbinger of the Midnight Sun. Prophecy or not, you overstep, challenging the Sorcerer Supreme. Be silent. Be still. Hello, daughter of Transia. You remind me of my own beloved. In virtute visanti! Well done, Miss Maximoff. Your unique energy surprised her. Whoa! I'm fine. What? I'm fine. The prophecy is in motion. Lilith is still out there growing stronger each second the Midnight Sun approaches. Define stronger. If we are to have any chance of stopping her, there is only one option left to us. I won't go back there. We all must eventually face our demons, Miss Maximoff. However, one of us should remain behind to maintain the wards of protection. See you on the other side. Ooh. Ooh, I'm in. I'm in. I I really knew I was gonna be, but yeesh, I'm so excited for this game. I'm so this is one of my most like looked forward to games of 2022. And now I finally get to play it. Okay. You did that one on purpose. The fabric of magic is unwinding. We are fortunate to be here at all. And where is here, exactly? Salem, Massachusetts. Well, a pocket dimension in Salem, Massachusetts. Oh, suburbs. Nice. Welcome to the Abbey. Home of the Midnight Sun. What the hell is this? Lilith's Junior Demon League? Wait, it's that jerk from TV. Which one? Now, if everyone would just take a moment... Enough! You're standing on my flowers. Oh, been a long time, Sarah. It's caretaker now. If I could have avoided this moment, I would, but... Oh, spare me the speech. I know Lilith's back. We are sisters after all. <laughs> Guess we're suddenly invisible now. Shall we chat, Stephen? No one can argue that the Hunter earned their rest in the first battle against Lilith. I only hope they are up for the task once more. You wizards always make everything sound so lofty. I raised my sister's only child as a weapon against her. And saved the world in the process. Now you want me to dig them up and ask them to do it again. I did not write the prophecy, Sarah. Besides, I am no common grave robber. We are simply reuniting their ethereal essence with their corporal form. Speaking of, it would help to have a mental image for the procedure. Spare no detail. Spiritual identity theft is no laughing matter. Okay, now we get to choose our character. Or make our character. Um, so I'm gonna speed up whenever you guys see this. I'm gonna speed through what we're making. Uh, so you're not gonna hear me talk. I'm just gonna speed through it.
light and darkness. You who tamed the night. Hear the voice of those who beseech the end. The caller! Wait! I've seen worse, particularly on myself. Tony, come on. It's perfectly safe. That thing wakes up and takes a bite out of you. Don't blame me. Visiting hours are over. You can't stay here forever. There's nowhere else I should be. Just saw that Stark guy poking around behind the mirror table. Find me as soon as they awaken. And Blade, be nice. Always am. The air burns with every breath. Has it been so long? I know this place. In my dreams it was always empty. Sense. I am not alone. Have to admit, Hunter, you make one hell of an entrance. Guess that makes two of us. You should have struck when you had the chance, vampire. You will not live to regret your error. Cute, and caretaker told me to be nice. Relax, Slayer, I'm a friend. You just don't know it yet. Yes, I saw you with Sarah before. But what would she want with a vampire, unless... The name's Blade, and I'm no ordinary vampire. I get you've been out of commission, but I thought you noticed since we're having this little showdown under the freaking sun. A dampier. Daywalkers were a myth, even to me. Says the half-human, half-demon monster hunter. Hmm. You appear quite versed in my history, Dampier. Heard my fair share of stories from Caretaker. The legendary hunter. Child of Lilith. Last champion of the blood. Some call you angel, some demon. Probably a little of both led the Knights of Wondagore against the armies of darkness until you fell at... Fell? Shoot. This is why they don't normally have me do the meet and greets. I can see why. Right. As much as I'd love to see how much weirder this conversation can go, we should probably get moving. Agreed. The prophecy is in motion. I can feel it. We have wasted too much time here already. Man, the others are really gonna love you. Others? Yeah, you've got a little fan club, I think. But why spoil the surprise? Hope you're up for the challenge, chosen one. And so now some of you are gonna be like, why bald? Why did you make your guy bald? 
Listen, the answer is, uh, I'm a sucker for self inserts. And I can't do anything about that. <laughs> and I'm bald. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Uh, one sec. I think I'm going to drop the graphics down again. I think I'm going to drop the graphics down again. We'll put it on medium. I'm going to put the textures on high. Maybe that was the issue. Maybe... Maybe that was the issue there. Alright, we're back. I had to... Whoa. Uh... Yeah, that's a problem. Hold on. What did I do? What did I do? That. Yeah, I don't... I don't want that. There you go. Hmm, the legend walks among us. Can I talk? Oh. Hunter. Not sure if you remember me, but we met briefly before. I'm... The witch who called me back from the grave. Told you. Or Nico, but neither works. And this is... Robbie Ray is. <laughs> oh, man. Never thought I'd be standing next to you. Got quite a rep. I mean, caretakers told us. Stories. That's Ileana. Privet. And I think you already met Blade. Of course. Caretaker has reformed the Midnight Suns. Whoa. How did you... Your power. I can feel it. I always do. So... Welcome home. I guess we... I never left. Right. Well, we can fast forward through the tour then. The Abbey is still, well, you know, the Abbey. Basic stuff. Dorms, war room, library, a few places to chill, and uh, whatever the hell the forge is. I have to say, for a haunted transient castle raised on the cursed grounds of old Salem, it's pretty cozy. Of course, that doesn't stop us from adding some improvements. We can all thank Robbie for the Wi-Fi. Oh, and one more thing. We've got some new house guests now. You think we're a fun bunch, just wait until you meet them. Speaking of, we're here. Yeah, okay, spend 10 minutes in this place alone, Bruce, then see. Oh, <clears throat> gotta go. Again. Okay. So that was Lilith, huh? She has a real 90s album cover vibe. 1690s, maybe. Hard to believe she's the hunter's mother. Resemblance dwindles when one is twisted by Cathan's power. Whose power? Cathan, the Elder God. Is Cathan the Elder God of Metal Bands? Oh, no. Tony, read your briefings. <laughs> Relax, I'm just spinning him up. You think now's really the time for that? I nearly broke my hand on Lilith's face. She didn't even flinch. The more dangerous the foe, the funnier I get. That's debatable. There isn't time for a refresher, much less that sort of I'm gonna try talking to him in just a sec. I just wanna see what they do here. Past experience is enough. Taking a big risk with your chosen one. You act as if I'm thrilled with the situation. If you're concerned, then be all the more vigilant out there. Easy for you to say. Nothing about any of this is easy, Blade. Yeah, tell that to Wanda. So Crazy day, huh? Crazy, indeed. Lots of new blood around here. Some seriously powerful headliners. Powerful, yes. But how powerful, we will see. Big personalities, too. I think you mean big egos. But none of that matters unless they can help us get to Wanda. I cannot wait to dive into the characters and like greeting them and whatnot. That's gonna be so cool. You following me, Doc? 
Maybe you should go introduce yourself to the young'uns. I'm sure they know of the Sorcerer Supreme, and I wasn't following you. How long have you two been sharing a room now? A day? Oh, I don't know. What do you say, Doc? Six, seven hours? Six hours, 43 minutes, eight seconds. And counting. Wow. And you're already bouncing off each other like an old married couple. Careful now. You're gonna make his cape jealous. It's a cloak, not a cape. And it definitely wouldn't be jealous of you. I'm calling it now. You two are gonna be best friends before this thing is over. All right. Uh, did someone give you a cup of coffee at least? I know I'm useless in the morning without a little boost. We could probably have one of these witches or warlocks magic you over a barista. No signs of muscle atrophy. You seem pretty healthy for a reanimated corpse. You sure you're not a time-traveling robot? I just feel the need to talk to each of them, just to, you I know, see what happens. Hunter, having studied the tomes and read of your exploits in the past, it had never occurred to me that we might someday face Lilith together. I give it about five minutes before Tony starts in with his ye old joke material. Sorry, Hunter. Never should have taken him to medieval times. <laughs> it's almost impossible to imagine the horror, the atrocities committed on these grounds all those years ago. Then again, we are less than 20 miles from Fenway Park. Unfortunately, time is of mm -hmm. the essence. Otherwise, I'd gladly offer to walk you through some of the more pivotal events that have changed the world since you last saw it. Yeah, like, uh, the hunter doesn't even know about cell phones, man. Can't talk to these guys. Well, I too was recruited as a child into a calling of power and violence. So far, it has worked out well for me. Magic is Colossus's sister, if I remember correctly. I, I wonder if you ever ran into any of my predecessors back in the day. We, um, uh, tend to stand out. Yeah, Ghost Rider? Alright. I wanna just check out Cyber. Is there anything worth looking at out here? Probably not. Let's just, uh, we'll just do the mission. We'll check out... I've heard that we need to like actually check out the Abbey, but we're gonna start off just doing this. Prophecies be damned. It's good to see that face again. You look like it was yesterday. And you look older. How long was I in that crypt, Sarah? No more than a few centuries. You were... missed. Centuries? And what of Lilith? Fallen by your hand. Until now. <clears throat> yeah, so speaking of Lilith... Tony? What? The kid's literally speaking of Lilith. Tony? That's my name. Tony. That's uh, Carol and Dr. Spooky over there. Here to help. Help with what, exactly? Oh, I don't know. Throwing the magic amulet into the volcano? <sighs> Smiting the dragon mother? You tell us, kid. You are the chosen one, after all. Do you recall anything of that last encounter, child? There was... a voice. The rest is... hazy. Oh, a voice. That's it? A voice? That's what we have to go on? Results of your long crypt sleep, most likely. A minor inconvenience. Everything required to restore those memories is contained within my sanctum. I will simply alert Wanda to prepare the necessary rituals. What? Straight to voicemail? Some sorcerer supreme. Must be mystical interference caused by this little pocket dimension of yours. Perhaps Agatha can help. Allow me. A lot of. Whoa, what kind of network you running there? 
the all-seeing eye of Ereshkigal who judges, bound to enchanted Babylonian soul glass. We just call it the mirror table. Wanda! The dark portal, pushing against the wards. Steven, where are you? That's impossible. Nothing on Earth could possibly affect those wards. Wanda's in trouble. Wanda is trouble. I'll go. You'll need my help, of course. Then let us make haste, Dr. Spooky. Our hunt begins now. Okay. And so, we go to war. With everything going on right now, we simply cannot afford to lose contact with the Sanctum or Wanda. All right, Sanctum Sanctorum contains many powerful artifacts which must be protected. Doctor Strange needs to find, needs to return to the Sanctum, find Scarlet Witch, and stabilize the wards. I really want to know the lore of this world, like what they, ha what has happened. Clearly, magic is here, so the X Men exist. Blade is here. I'm just, I'm very interested, like curious if we're gonna get any idea of what the history of this universe is. Okay, so there's us. Uh, so show missing mission details. There we go. We got that. We're good to go. Even given the fluctuations in the astral spectrum, I should be seeing something. Unless Bruce is right about gamma interference, <laughs> if such a thing could even exist. The wards have been activated before, and I've never experienced such a reaction. Or perhaps I have simply erased that timeline so as not to affect my own destiny. I am quite efficient with my future and past selves in that regard. Uh -huh. Are you ready? The prophecy of the Midnight Sun does not linger, and neither should we. Lilith possesses the Dark Hold. If she forced her way into my Sanctum Sanctorum once, I suspect she can do it again. You are a Sorcerer Supreme. Can you not predict her movements? Normally, yes. But since your mother breached the Sanctum, my sense of the future has grown voluminous in nature. Is that another language, or...? Ah... <sighs> Fuzzy. My predictions are fuzzy. For the first time, a Sorcerer Supreme, I cannot foresee how the future unfolds, and with my apprentice in danger, we cannot tarry. Alright. Uh, don't worry, Doctor. We'll save your home. Your sanctum will survive. We shall see to that. Indeed. The Sanctum Sanctorum has weathered its fair share of trouble over the years. Lay storms, a few short-tempered celestials, that issue with the Zoning Commission. But this time, it feels... different. I do not doubt Wanda's capability, but without my predictive acumen, I cannot bolster the wards should she need it. Still, the wards are woven into the Sanctum's very essence. They should hold. In any case, all will be revealed with time. I suggest we make use of it while it still functions. Okay. So, damn, we're sprinting off to this freaking thing. Here we go. About time. Not just about time. Mr. Brooks, time, space, reality, the building blocks of magic. All must be constant for my portals to work properly. Yet as we now know, that is no longer the case. We've heard. Several times. Otherwise, I would still be hunting dread maidens in my sleep. Indeed. And while I certainly appreciate the view of this vista, I fail to see how it will hasten our return to the Sanctum. Magic is the answer. No, as I've just stated, magic is the problem. Your magic is... not ours. The ground you are standing on exists within two worlds. A mystical anchor point to Ileana's realm that allows her to... Well, I'll just let her show you.
questions. Enter the portal to Limbo. As much as I'd love to hear a first hand account of your Wanda belongs Oops. here. Bring her back safe. What? You've never seen Portal before? I don't care what Strange says. I'm only going to the Sanctum to give Wanda some backup. Alright, let's go. You are standing in Limbo. Nexus of all realities, both real or otherwise. A chaotic but secret realm beyond the influence of Lilith. Thus far. Are you certain of that? Because I am sensing all kinds of dark energy. That feeling you're being watched. General Hellho vibe? Yes. All these potentialities converging at once? A truly surprising feat, Miss Rasputin. For someone so young, of course. Think this is crazy. Wait until you see Manhattan. I guess that was like an alternate universe us, huh? From here, magic can open gateways to just about anywhere on our planet and beyond. We don't want to risk punching through the wards protecting your sanctum, Doctor. So we've chosen a safe exit a few blocks over instead. <laughs> Couldn't be worse than the last time. It was just a simple miscommunication. Ocean Avenue. I said Ocean Avenue, Magic. <laughs> you got dropped into the middle of the ocean or something. Jeez. Let's go. Combat items never cost a play a card play when used in combat, but the powerful effects can tip the balance. Combat items. That's not the. It's not the stuff, right? You know the wards of protection are still in place. For now. I suggest we hurry. resistance between you and the sanctum looks can be deceiving i'm afraid there's no way these foot soldiers are behind the disruption of the wards of protection okay so <clears throat> what are we dealing with here we got a minion a big baddie and two elites so they're called again um so uh, give hero cards in your hand plus five damage until played or discarded. Interesting. Blade chain two. We have a heal. I'm gonna redraw this. Okay. Uh, no, great. I'm gonna redraw this again. Uh, Axe of Angar. Rumus. Okay, so, this is what I'm thinking. Uh, I do know that this is a crit, so this is, when you see this pulled up and there's like the flame on the sword or whatever, that means that it's gonna crit. Uh, so, we have knockback, we have six damage and a crit, or that is the crit. Uh, what do we do here? Three card plays. 
We don't need this yet. Well... Let's do this. Oh. Interesting. We could go whack this guy with this. Do 20 damage to him. Uh, knock back and quick. So quick. On KO, refund a card play. Interesting. So... Tax for the keyword quick. We'll refund the card play. Okay. Um, let's... That would work. Let's try that. And we're gonna get some damage on this guy. So that's not bad. That's one hell of a move. And we got the card play back. Okay, perfect. So... Uh, what do we do? What is this? All oh, 15 damage? So why do you do that? Okay, so if you're in a certain spot, you can do that. Paper does 10 damage. Kicking this thing does 10 damage. Uh, alright. So let's see. Two card plays. This is a crit. This does 10 damage to two people. Oh, you know what? What if we do this and this? You kissed the mother with that mouth? Right. So, what if we switch to Doctor Strange? Can we jump on him? No. Alright, alright, alright. We have one card play left. But then we do have heroism that we're building. So I do think. Oh, this is 30? Oh, knock this guy out. Take him out! That looks so I'm glad freaking to have your cool. Magic on our okay, so he does 10. I think. Oh, he has 20 health there too. Okay. Okay, so what if we... Does this only vault that way? What if I move here? Oh, I see. Yeah, you know what? I'm happy with that. Once a hero uses move, they can continue to reuse move to reposition themselves until any... He oh! So I can keep moving. Okay, cool. They have performance action. Because we don't have any heroism. Alright, alright. Because we use the axe. That makes sense. That's not supposed to hurt. They hope to break my resolve. Yeah, they're not gonna break my resolve either. Reinforcements on approach. Okay. That gamma spike we detected we in your area strike. seems to be growing. Let's assume that's not a good thing. Um, gamma or not, I feel the hand of my mother at work here. So we know quick strike, or uh, quick means we get the re the uh, card back. So if it kills an enemy, that's right. So let's kill an enemy. Or sorry, KO an enemy. With three card plays, we can whip this guy. So forceful knockback. Forceful knockback means that. I think it's like you can move them through multiple objects or something like that. I mean, obviously this one seems more concrete, so you can't really do that. Um, you know what? What if we move Doctor Strange here? And he looks so cool. He looks so, so, so cool. I hope this is one of the stronger arms. All right. We did come all the way here for a fight. So, you can do... You can do this. Your fate is sealed. So I'll knock him out. 
Hail that. We've got two card plays left. We're not going to have the heroism to do either of these, so let's redraw. I don't hate that. Can he ch critical abilities? All damage dealing hero abilities have a chance to become critical when they're drawn. Critical abilities deal increased damage. The chance for an ability to be critical is determined by a hero's critical chance stat. The bonus damage dealt by a critical ability is determined by a hero's critical damage stat. Okay, makes sense. So can we? Yes, we can. This is not going to kill either one of them. Did we? You know what? We're going to redo this. Make him bleed. Oh, I do know what this does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so he's going to cause life or uh, bleed. But we also get... Alright, well, it's not really what we needed, honestly. Ah! Oh, maybe it'll work. Let's try this. So they're going to bleed. possibly match your strength. We're out of these cards. Um, they're gonna bleed for 10 damage. They, these guys are dead after their turn, which is disappointing. That wasn't very nice. Oh, we'll get them. Guided as they are, remember, Hydra is still human, Hunter, not Lilin. You were saying? The lifeblood of the Mother pumps through our veins. The Mother is eternal. Hydra is eternal. You wanna bet? Fine, I can't wait. Defeat Fallen Venom to complete the mission. Fallen Venom symbiote binds can be broken by attacking them with hero abilities. Okay. Powerful enemies like Fallen Venom do not forecast which hero they intend to attack and may attack multiple times on their turn. Watch out. All right. Well, that certainly escalated quickly. Do I even want to know what that beast is? It calls itself Venom. Until now, a pale imitation of a very heroic young friend of mine. Oh, we, we still have this in our head. your ugly tongue to the spider wizard. Marinate it in his stomach juices and eat it with his spleen. Okay. So, I mean, first let's go take out this guy. Weak, even for Hydra. Uh, I'm a little confused how he, Hunter, knows about Hydra already. Enough to call them weak. But that's just me. Can we knock him back into this? Let's do that. Okay. 
When a unit is stunned, they will not act on their turn. If a stun unit takes damage, they will be reawakened immediately. Alright, so stuns... good. Um... Uh, we need one more heroism to do that. We could do... Let's do this. Ooh, a level up. Today. We got a quick strike. That is beautiful. It's on. It's weirdos like these that give people like us a bad reputation. Uh, and you know what? Let's do this, dude. What? Because now this next turn, this next turn we're gonna have four. Uh, and then. The next one damage card applies to blade. Okay. So let's go back to the hunter and. I don't know. Uh, let's get him like. Here. And we'll just end with that. Peel back your flesh! Oh. stronger than its fists is its breath. Okay, so he only got stunned for one action, I guess. This house belongs to Mother, and you belong to us. We should start with your juicy entrails, then slowly Wait. your delicious brains. Uh. Are the rest of your mother's children so chatty? Yeah, let's do this. Thankfully, no. He's got the bleed and the life steal. And I got Symbiote skin. Melee attacks against Fallen Venom can trigger his Join Us passive and activate Symbiote skin. When Symbiote skin is active, Fallen Venom will bind the next hero that melee attacks him. After triggering Symbiote skin, use ranged or area attack to reset him. Okay, this is ranged. Let's go take him now. They're mine. Keep some for the rest of us. Uh, we need to reset him, right? Where can we send him? We could send him. Okay, wait. Let's... We can do this. This is gonna be 10 damage. We have three cards to play. A reset and two of those. Which has knockback. We could knock him into two other things. Ah, uh, no, because once we melee him... I'm gonna do that too. Okay. Alright, alright. It, it wants us to do this, so fine. Uh, Blade, we're gonna move you out of the way. Stop stalling! Actually, I think I just did not do what I wanted to do. Good. Can Hunter move? No, alright. I just messed it up a little bit, but that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna send him through this towards that. That looks so freaking cool, man. And we get the level up. Nice. Okay, symbiote skin removed. Discarded that. Hit him with that. And he didn't get the symbiote skin, so we're good. Look how fragile you are. Now, that's not I've great. Hit like that since. You will suffer for that. Uh huh. So we're trapped. He's bleeding. That's good. 
A hero is bound and unable to act. Use other hero abilities to damage the binding and freedom. Binding sword will be moved by with any damage similar to me. So could you knock somebody we into We may that? not be ready for this thing yet. Might be smarter to pull back until we know what we're up against here. Yes. Surrender. Be eaten. Fill our belly with your tasty fear. <laughs> I shall fill your belly with my blade, demon. Hunter, you're really not in a place to talk right now. You're kind of trapped. Enemy area attacks will go off at the end of the turn. Use move or an ability to move any nearby heroes to safety. Knock enemies into the area attack to turn the tables on your foot. Oh. Okay. Uh, well. I'll tell you what will work here. We do have knockback, right? And we can move him away. Obviously, we won't take those guys down. We could knock back either of them in position. Um, let's. I think I want to do this, honestly. First, Time here. to bleed. Impressive. Okay, card play refunded. We don't want to get in that. Um. Actually, what might not be terrible? What is this? What if we knock him into that? Does he reset? No. Okay. Okay, he does not reset. Um... He's got 45 health left. We can kill him. Let's do that. I didn't mess it up, right? Yeah, there we go. Get in there, Blade. Don't get up. No escape from me, demon. Hold up. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. <laughs> Friendly. Seemed like you folks could use a hand, Doc. <coughs> Spider Man! Jeez, Eddie, what happened to you? That's part of a horrifyingly terrible new look. The tongue was gross enough, but. Whoa! Someone is extra touchy today. We will rip your face off and suck the pearl from your bones! Always nice to see you too, buddy. So, I'm thinking your friends here could use a little break. How about I take Eddie here for his afternoon walk? <laughs> Don't worry, Doc. That's just his way of saying he cares! <laughs> <laughs> And we got the three-star mission ready. That's nice. That is nice. Um, so something that I saw is that you can edit the photo here. And you can... Where is it? Oh, you can randomize. So you can uh, randomize and make this thing. I think I'm going to do this because apparently later on you can put this into your... Um, into your abbey which sounds just absolutely sick. So 
Um, I'm going to randomize until we get like a really cool one. The Marvelous Invaders, Doctor Strange, Doctor Strange, Doctor Strange. All right, they're a little obsessed with Doctor Strange here, huh? The Hunter. The Hunter. Defenders of Light. Oh, this one looks... Yeah, 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 yeah. Take that. Photos can be viewed by visiting the gallery in Superlink. Any photo could be converted to a painting that could be hung on the walls of the Abbey. Yeah, exactly that. So there we go. Take that. We're going to keep doing that for for all the missions that we have. Because I just think that's such a sick thing. Just like XCOM. I just think it's so cool.